European foreign ministers are set to discuss the political crisis in Ukraine and developments in Moldova and Georgia as the two prepare to sign EU partnership agreements in coming months. The EU has urged an end to violence against peaceful demonstrators in Ukraine and called for a genuine and inclusive political dialogue to resolve the standoff. The Union insists that Ukraine should be free to choose its international partners and that strong ties with the EU do not come at the expense of relations with the country's neighbours, notably Russia. Moldova and Georgia initialed partnership agreements with the EU late last year and are due to sign those accords before the end of August. The ministers are also likely to discuss the military operation planned for the Central African Republic. The operation would provide security in the capital for up to six months until an African peacekeeping mission can take over. Developments in the post-Arab spring countries, notably Egypt, Libya and Tunisia, are also on the agenda. The ministers will assess the outcome of the constitutional referendum in Egypt last month and take stock of security and political developments in Libya. The Council will also debate events in Tunisia after a new constitution was adopted on the 26th of January. In November, the ministers affirmed the EU's backing for Tunisia, encouraged the holding of credible elections and offered continued support in tackling its challenges.